awesome fearless virgos i missed you guys virgo i love you guys so much i hope you're doing wonderful it's sunday morning ym i hope you're having a beautiful relaxing sunday virgo you want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate first we're going to ask what's coming towards you virgo what you'll be dealing with facing in your life and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey second part of this video we're going to ask about your soulmate whoever it is you're thinking of concentrating on when watching this video whether you're currently in contact with them or not first we're going to ask how this person is doing at this time and how they are currently <clears throat> relating to you emotionally what's on their mind what they thinking feeling at this time especially in relation to you virgo Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Virgo, for Virgo's highest good, please. Universe, what's coming towards Virgo in their life? And how is Virgo currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming towards Virgo in their life? And how is Virgo currently doing on their soulmate journey? Oh, this one wants to come out very strongly. For some reason, two of them, I don't know why, two of them want to come out, not one. Oh, Virgo. <clears throat> Whatever it is that you feel betrayed about, whoever betrayed you, or be, you feel betrayed your trust, or friendship, or relationship, or connection, you're going to be victorious at dealing with that situation. Yeah, somebody's trying to hide something from you. Uh, and it's uh, something that would be um, creating some chaos in your life because this is showing up in position one. <clears throat> you may not be aware of it yet because your back is turned towards it. Let me see. Wow. The devil is reversed, which is good. You are releasing a toxic connection from your life. You are successfully letting go toxic situations, people from your life. So whether it's toxic relatives, toxic soulmates, friends, toxic coworkers, you are releasing successfully. Um, yeah, let's do this. Universe, please show us. What's coming towards Virgo and how is Virgo currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming towards Virgo in their life? And how is Virgo currently doing on their soulmate journey? <clears throat> yeah, you see, you decided to be alone. You're not in a relationship right now. Yeah, you're not in a relationship. You view yourself as single, available. Something to do with your money. Uh, job business uh, that will be a success you're gonna make some kind of important decision about your job or business and it's gonna be uh, the right decision because profit is showing up here financial success stability in the yeah look at all this money nine of Pentacles six of Pentacles ten of Pentacles two of Pentacles and victory card six of Wands somebody wants to communicate with you <sighs> Somebody who hasn't been communicating with you, they think you moved on already. Uh, somebody wants to express something to you. They have a lot to tell you that they've been holding back. Yeah, you haven't been taking action uh, towards your soulmate. Yeah, so that is your soulmate. You haven't been taking action towards them. You view yourself as single in this connection. <clears throat> wow. Uh, you're going to be victorious at something to do with your job or business. Yeah, look at this. Victory. Again, after great emotional struggles. You have new soulmates entering your life as well. So somebody from your past wants to reconnect with you, speak with you, and somebody new entering your life. Yeah. Uh, King of... Pentacles, my favorite king of all kings, king of pentacles, somebody new that's mature, that's grounded, that's reliable, that's successful. Mm. 
Let me see what's going on here. You're releasing someone who's been toxic in your life. Yeah. You will successfully release someone who's been uh, draining your energy because the devil is reversed, which is good. Universe, please show us what's coming towards Virgo and how is Virgo currently doing on their soulmate journey? Yeah, you see? Yeah, you see very clearly who you need to release. You see? Whoever it is that you are releasing successfully, uh, emotionally, physically from your life, uh, has caused you a lot of disappointment, heartbreak, you see? And this is you deciding for your highest good to release someone who's been uh, draining you, you are releasing. So whether it's relatives or soulmates or friends who haven't been there for you, but you've been there for them, you are releasing for your highest good and you're going to be successful at it, you see? <clears throat> yeah. You have uh, people interested in you, Virgo. Wow. <laughs> the person that wants to come back to you that minutes ago showed up as Page of Swords is now <coughs> showing up as Emperor, but they don't hold Emperor's energy. Yeah. They, and they feel they uh, mm, disappointed you greatly, and that's why you're quiet. And they know they owe you explanations, apologies, but their back is turned towards that. So they don't really directly want to apologize, but they want to somehow gain your trust. But I think you're done with that situation. The devil is reversed. You are releasing anything that has been draining you, anyone that hasn't reciprocated, communicated effectively, showed you love. Uh, showed you attention like you've showed them. So you are successfully releasing uh, toxic situations, toxic connections, toxic relationships, whether it's uh, family members or friends or neighbors or coworkers or soulmates. You are releasing all those that have uh, drained your energy. Yeah, universe, please show us. So let's do a reading about the person you're thinking of while watching this video. You know, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Virgo. For Virgo's highest good, please. Universe, the soulmate of Virgo. The soulmate of Virgo. What's going on currently with the soulmate of Virgo? And how is the soulmate of Virgo currently relating to Virgo, especially emotionally and what's on soulmate's mind at this time i feel i need to shuffle more you know please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of virgo and how is the soulmate of virgo currently relating to virgo especially emotionally and what's on soulmate's mind let's see oh they're scared of approaching you they feel blocked they're scared of approaching you hmm they want to approach you though. This is them. All nights deliver something. Knight of Cups delivers emotions, feelings, explanations, apologies. Yeah, you see? They view you as the catch. This person views you as someone of great value. Wow, this person's heartbroken. They feel like they lost you. But this shows me that whoever this person is, your soulmate, uh, is aware they caused you a lot of heartbreak, disappointment. They are aware of it. Yeah, you see? And they want to make it up to you. They want to uh, make amends with you, but they're scared that it's too late, that you're going to block them. Yeah. Let's see the subconscious position. Yeah, they want new beginning with you, Virgo. This person has a lot of passion for you. They don't express emotions very easily. They don't communicate they don't communicate well, like they hesitate in communication. They don't like to initiate communication. <sighs> My goodness, Virgo. Yeah, whoever it is caused you a lot of heartbreak. Yeah, but they are aware of it. They know. Universe, please show us um, what's going on currently with the soulmate of Virgo and how is the soulmate of Virgo currently relating to Virgo, especially emotionally, and what's on soulmate's mind. <clears throat> They've been silent, quiet, on the sidelines, sort of speak. Yeah, they've been silent. 
<clears throat> yeah, they want to come towards you, Virgo. Yeah, I see. They view you as, as someone of high value, someone with integrity, class. They want to fix whatever was done wrong. They want to fix it. Yeah, I see. They think very highly of you. Lover's energy. This person wants to be back in your life. Missing you a lot. A lot. Yeah, this is them feeling very sad without you in their life, without your communication. A lot of you are dealing with Capricorn, Virgo, Libra, Taurus, Gemini. Wow. This person did not expect to miss you so much. They did not expect to be so deeply emotionally affected by your silence, by your absence from their life. Yeah. You had to let them go. The universe is showing you very clearly the tower moment. You had to let them go because they drained you. I don't think they drained you on purpose, but uh, they could, either couldn't um, step up to the plate and offer you what you've been offering them or they didn't want to. Yeah, I see you are single available. <clears throat> you are very attractive, very attractive. You have a lot of people interested in you, but this shows another very important message. You have some uh, very fake people at your job or business. Yeah, you have people jealous of you. Uh, you are a very diligent worker. You are respected. You are admired by people. You have jealousy towards you at your job or business. So you know what that means. When people are jealous, that means you're doing something right. You keep doing what you're doing. Just watch your back. <clears throat> yeah. Hmm. Wow. Let me see what's going on here with this soulmate of yours. Universe, please show us um, what's going on currently with the soulmate of Virgo. And how is the soulmate of Virgo towards Virgo at this time? A lot of you are dealing with the fire sign Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. <clears throat> wow. This person loves you quietly from a distance. So they have... Deep love for you, but not expressing it, not showing it, not verbalizing it. And they have passion for you. <clears throat> yeah, they view you as marriage material. This person's hoping, wishing for you to be back in their life. Yeah, I see. They want to put work into this all of a sudden. Yeah, so they recognize they didn't reciprocate. Yeah, that you had to let them go. Yeah, now they're trying to figure out if there's somebody else in your life. You see? They're scared to approach you because they think that maybe there's somebody else in your life, but they really want to uh, reconcile with you, Virgo. Virgo, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about the soulmate's true, genuine, long-term intentions and plans for you. What are they planning long-term? Then we're going to ask what they're currently hiding from you, what they have up their sleeve, whether they're hiding it on purpose or can communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle this soulmate connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life, including new soulmates, new chapters, new beginnings in your life, also your health, finances, business, job, opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know. They'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So we're going to click on the extended link below this video in the description box below. And I'll see you there. Love you guys.